guys, welcome to a new episode of a new class, gasoline class, inboards and outboards, gasoline engines, marine gasoline engines. This is the chapter number one. I hope you enjoy this class the same that you enjoy my previous classes. If you are a new student of Mr. Lopez classes, before you take this class, I have one, I have two recommendations. One recommendation. I recommend take my basic electricity class. What is the meaning of that? The course of the electrical class. Take the first H episode. The electrical class is divided in basic electricity, DC current, and advanced electricity, AC current. I recommend Check my videos related with the first eight chapters, electrical, DC. This is a prerequisite to understand this class. And other class that I recommend is the class of Diesel 1. Diesel 1 is once again the first eight episodes, eight chapters, the first eight chapters of the Diesel Engines class. Because in those first eight chapters, we disassemble the engine completely and we study all the parts separated. Pistons, block, crankshaft, camshaft, that. It's pretty similar. The engines are pretty similar. Doesn't matter if are inboard or outboard gas or diesel. The construction, the piston, the valve, the head. If you understand those procedures, in the diesel one class will be great for use. And after that, you are very welcome to my gasoline class. In this class, we are going to study four basic systems for inboards and outboards. Fuel systems, lubrication systems, cooling systems, for both of them, inboard and outboard. Electrical systems included in the electrical systems, the electronic parts, the sensors, the harness, and the codes, and troubleshoot. The troubleshooting for those sensors. This is a wonderful episode where I explain sensor by sensor where is located the sensor, the symptoms, the solution, sensor by sensor. And other video related with the oil sample analysis. We are going to check element by element dispersed in the oil. What is the problem if you have high level of that element? Where is located the problem and how is the solution? And we are going to study and we are going to analyze the coolant sample analysis for inboards, the analysis of the coolant, and we are going to analyze all the dispersed minerals, metals, contaminants, and additives. And we are going to check where is located the excess of that element, what happened, and what is the solution. Three excellent episodes, coolant report analysis, oil sample analysis, and sensor code analysis. If you understand those three videos, you are a doctor in engines, gas or diesel. I hope you enjoy this class. I hope you enjoy each particular video. If you have questions, if you have suggestions, please write to my email, info at mrlopezclasses.com. For me, it's a pleasure work for yours.